Okay, um, hi guys. It's Sky here. I'm, I'm like so excited, but I'm like so nervous at the same time. Um, I'm actually going to be doing my first ear stretching video, and I know today's not like, um, Saturday, Friday, whatever. <laughs> Crap, I can't even remember what. But, um, since I didn't do any video this Saturday, here it is, so I'm late, but oh well. And, um, I'm actually going to be stretching my ears for the first time. And right now, I'm pretty sure my ears are at like a 17 gauge, I'm going to guess. Yeah, 17 gauge. By my ear piercings, I mean my first holes, not the one that's most seen. I have two low piercings, but the others are closing, so I'm just letting those heal up. So, in their healing process, they look a lot more darker. Um, I just have my papers, and I don't have any jewelry for this, so I'm just going to use the tapers as jewelry, and I know that that can cause uneven stretching, but I, oh well, I can't really afford any jewelry that's not like an acrylic or anything, and I know that the acrylics, while you're waiting for them, for your ears to heal, that the acrylics, that they can heal to the acrylics, and you'd have to like tear it out of your ear to take it out. So, yeah. I'm not risking that. Is there a little O-ring things I have? You can't see it because it's like so small. Oh, I dropped it. Maybe I can use something to stick to my ear. Oh, oh. Yay, that's it. Okay. <laughs> I'm so awkward. But, um, I'm just using Vaseline. So, uh, to... I don't want to say um, the actual word used for this, but yeah, so many different dirty-minded ways to think of this. But um, yeah, I'm just covering this with Vaseline so it's easier to stretch and won't hurt as much. Mm going to, I don't know, I think I'm just going to do this here first, so, I need a mirror, I just realized that, crap, I'll use my camera as a mirror, or, yeah, I could just probably use this as a mirror, but, I know that you just have to, like, massage this, whatever, on your ear and on the taper, so that's what I'm doing. Okay. Nerp. My ear is so weird. Oh my god, don't mind that curly piece of hair. Ah. This is so difficult. I'm scared that it's gonna hurt. Okay, I feel a little pain. I'm really scared. It's starting to hurt a little bit. Done. That actually didn't hurt that bad. So, I'm just going to get these little suckers on. It's probably going to be a bit difficult, but. Uh, I can't see. 
see anything I'm doing, so this sucks. Okay. Yes. This makes me so happy, even though it's only 14 gauge. Okay, now for the other one. Take the rings off. Get off, you little. You must not curse on my YouTube. <laughs> Live that Oi. I'm getting more excited now. <laughs> I'm sorry if there's any of my cleavage that exposes in this video, since the top I'm wearing is, like, very low cut. Uh, I'm finding this so dirty minded. Curse my brain. Here. Yas. This lobe is like so much smaller than the other one, like less thick, I guess you could say. It feels so weird though. It's like the other one's all fluffy, like it's just naturally like that. And this one's like less fluffy. I don't know. <laughs> Being random. Uh, It's gonna be more difficult because, like, this side, I don't know. Ooh. Eh. Difficulties of using your webcam as a mirror. Nope. I have a feeling this is my bad ear. It's already starting to hurt. Owie, 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 owie. Yep, this is my bad ear. <laughs> no. My goal size is a six gauge. So. This hurts. Okay, done. Girl, oh, you can't really see that because of my hair. Now, time for the ring thingies. They're still like Vaseline all over them. Oh, wait. It's on. It's not even on. This one's being so difficult. Ugh. good so these are my 14 gauge ears yes stupid um okay that wasn't that bad that was my baseline i'm actually really happy about them because <laughs> Yes. Like, I've always had, like, I don't know, something about, like, stretched ears. Like, I don't know, they just, like, fascinate me. It's like, 
they fascinate me some weird way. So I'm just like really happy now that I'm going to be stretching my ears. And I'm going to wait a week for these to heal because that's probably the average healing time I'm going to assume. And I've done research that says wait probably like at least a week between stretchings, even if it's not like completely healed. Um, but I have more tapers that are actually go up to my current goal size, which is a six gauge. And um, for now, I'm only hoping to get at most to a six gauge. Um, I'm planning on later probably getting to a two or a zero gauge. But, or maybe at least a four gauge. So, yeah. I actually, I like these. The only thing is, like, the tapers are, like, poking the back of my neck. Like, they're just sitting there. This is so weird to describe because it's like, see, it just keeps poking the back of my neck. And it doesn't hurt or anything, it's just, like, annoying. I can't feel them that bad. <laughs> I'm like bobbing my head back and forth. Oh god. No. <laughs> okay, um, I'm just gonna end this episode here. And if um I might sometime get my tragus pierced, but I'm probably going to wait till after I'm done with my small little stretching journey for that so yay um yeah i'll see you in my next video um 